Hello fellow stackers, 365 here, welcome back to my channel. So just a quick thank you video to Terry Pitt. Now Terry Pitt is one of my subscribers and he is the first person to buy me some whiskey. Now for those of you that haven't heard of it, there's a website called Buy Me A Coffee and I saw it in another stacker's channel. I can't think who it was now, but it was another stacker that I follow and they had it in their description when I was looking at their description for ideas. I can't remember now what YouTuber it was, but I was looking through their description for ideas of what to put in my descriptions. And in their description, they had affiliate codes and things like that. And at the bottom, they had a little link that said, click here to buy me a coffee. So I was intrigued. I clicked on it. I actually brought them a coffee because I thought it was a cool idea. And basically what it is, it's like a tip jar, if you like. Now, I don't really drink coffee that much. And as you know, my drink of choice is a good old whiskey. So I went on the website and I thought, I wonder if there's a way that you can change it to buy me a whiskey instead. And there is. You, although the website's called buy me a coffee, you can change it to whatever you want. So you can say buy me a sandwich, for example, buy me a tea. Whatever you want, you can change it to. So I changed mine to buy me a whiskey. And it says on there, this is the email that I received. And it says, Terry Pitt brought a whiskey. Congrats on your 6K followers. Have a drink on me. So really, really generous. Thank you very much, Terry. I really appreciate that. I hope you're watching this video. I have sent you a separate email thanking you as well. I literally just put it in my description. I thought it'd be interesting to see if anyone stumbles across it. And like I said, I don't really want this channel to be one of those channels where I'm reaching out for funding and things like that, because this is a bit of a hobby. But I have got things like that in the description where you can support the channel if you want. You can obviously join the paid subscription of my channel, which is $4.99 a month, and you get early access to videos. You get priority reply and comments. You get behind the scenes photos. You get behind the scenes videos and things like that. You can also, like I said, buy me a whiskey. And I've also got a merch store on there. But like I said, I don't like pushing these out there because that's not what this channel's about. This channel is for a hobby, for me for documenting my journey. And this is never going to be kind of a way of replacing my income. That's not what I want this to be. Because if I made this my kind of full-time gig, if you like, it would become very stressful. It would become very focused on just pushing out content that's going to get views instead of pushing out content that I like doing. And for those of you that have watched my channel, it's very all over the place. I do Lego builds. Next minute, I'm talking about CBDCs. The next minute, I'm sitting there with a, a glass of whiskey and talking about silver. So you never really know what video I'm going to upload on this channel. It's all a bit all over the place. And I feel like if I tried to use this channel as a way of replacing my job and replacing my income, I wouldn't be able to have as much fun with it. I'd be overthinking every single video. Every single video, I'd be like, right, I have to do a video that does really, really well because I need to be able to pay my mortgage this month, for example. So I don't want it to be like that. I want this channel to stay as a hobby. I want it to stay as a bit of fun. And obviously the ad revenue is a, is a bonus and I will be reinvesting that back into the channel by purchasing silver, by purchasing better camera equipment and all the rest of it. So yeah, this video is kind of a way of saying thank you very much to, to Terry Pitt for buying me a whiskey. Thanks for being the first person to discover that link in my description and and support the channel. I really, really do appreciate it. And for those of you that have commented on my previous videos suggesting whiskies and telling me that you like whiskies as well, I do really appreciate it. I like trying lots of different whiskies. Now, this is the latest whiskey that I've been drinking. You've probably seen it in a couple of videos. It's called Gold Reserve. And I haven't really got a favorite in terms of a whiskey that I keep going back to. What I like to do is I like to go on Amazon and the rough price guide in my head is £25. And I have a search for whiskey and whatever comes up that I haven't tried before that fits around the £25 mark, I just buy it. Now, some are obviously better than others and it's a complete gamble on what I'm getting. I normally look at one that's got kind of a few stars. I wouldn't buy one if it only had one stars, for example, on the review side of things. So I always do tend to go for ones that have like kind of four stars and up. So I'm never really going to end up with a really disgusting whiskey. But obviously, everyone's taste is slightly different. And some of them I prefer over others. But at the moment, this is the one I'm drinking. It's really, really nice. Like I said, it was £25, and I think it was reduced from around £44, I think it was. So it's obviously normally sells for quite a lot more. And that's what's quite good when I just 
pick up different whiskies here and there and I'm not searching for a particular brand, I'm not restricted. I can literally buy whatever whiskey I want. And sometimes you can get some really nice whiskies that are like reduced sort of half price on special offer. And then I just try them. And like I said, I don't often buy the same whiskey again because I like trying different things. So yeah, let me know what you think about that. What is your tipple of choice? Do you prefer beers? Do you prefer spirits? Do you like a whiskey like myself? Or do you not even drink at all? I know a lot of people that started stacking I spoke to a number of stackers now that actually don't drink. They used to drink quite a lot and they used to spend a lot of money on drinking. But when they discovered stacking, they ended up putting the money that they used to spend down the pub and on beers into silver instead. And they kind of use silver as a way of motivating themselves to stop drinking. So that's quite inspirational as well. Me personally, I do like a drink. So, yeah, I like I like beers. I like whiskey. I'll pretty much... Uh, drink anything really but whiskey is kind of my go-to drink at the moment so yeah anyway let's get straight into the video i've got another whiskey here to unbox and once again i want to say thank you very much to terry pitt because your donation has gone towards me buying this bottle so yeah i really really do appreciate that and like i said i hadn't even mentioned it in any of my videos i don't think about me having that link in the description so he must have just been looking through my description saw it said buy me a whiskey and he and he just donated. So yeah, really, really kind of him. So let's get into the video and let's have a little look at the whiskey that Terry has helped buy. So this arrived literally probably 20 minutes ago from Amazon. A lot of box and wrapper for a kind of small bottle. But we have gone for bourbon. I do quite like bourbon. Look at that. That's quite a cool bottle. It's like a really thin looking bottle. When I pick my whiskies, I do like ones that have corks in them. I don't know why. There's something about opening a corks bottle of whiskey. I think it's the way it sounds more than anything. It's a really satisfying. It's a really nice sound. And it just makes it feel like such a more expensive whiskey. You could have a really cheap bottle of whiskey, but if it's got a cork, suddenly it feels like it's an expensive bottle. If you've got a little flimsy screw top, it just takes away the enjoyment of pouring yourself a whiskey. So, so yeah, quite nice that this has got a cork. And I haven't tried this before. This is called Woodford Reserve, and it's a bourbon whiskey. 43%, so quite a strong one. Like I said, it's quite a thin bottle, quite a cool looking bottle. And that's another thing, like I said at the beginning of the video, I like the flexibility of being able to do whatever content I want on this channel. And that is the difference from when you kind of go full time into YouTube. If you choose to go down that route, you kind of stick to one lane, you kind of work out what videos do well, and you just purely do those videos. Now, for those of you that have been watching my videos for a while, you'll know that my bank videos and my CBDC videos do really, really well. And I will continue to do those videos because it makes sense. That's what my target audience seem to enjoy. They like keeping up to date with the current updates. But at the same time, a lot of my original subscribers, they subscribe just for watching me unbox silver coins and just kind of be myself and, and talk and that is why I like the fact that this will never ever be my full-time job because I can just do whatever videos I like and some of you might watch this video and say this isn't for me I, I followed you to watch about CBDCs and the bank closures and I want to see more silver unboxings or some people might even say I want to see more Lego builds you know what I mean so it's all different people that have followed my channels for different reasons but Today's video is about whiskey and bourbon, and, and that's just because that's what I'd like to talk about today. So, so yeah, let me know, like I said in the comment section, what your drink of choice is. Do you like a whiskey? Now, I can't take full credit for picking this whiskey myself because this was actually recommended to me by Every Cloud. Now, you can see if it's going to focus. Every Cloud two seven four five. He is a long-term subscriber of this channel. He supports the channel, he comments on all the videos, he's really, really true, loyal fan of the channel. And he wrote a comment on one of my videos saying, currently going through a bottle of Woodford Reserve, which is quite nice. I do, I do enjoy malts, but I think overall I'm more of a bourbon drinker. Liking your lighting setup, I'll be here for part 32 of the Lego build. Hello, Mrs. 365s. Good to see you on again. So although he's kind of chatting up my missus a little bit at the end there, 
he also recommended a nice bourbon for me to try. So every cloud, thank you very much for recommending this. I will have a glass of this in a future video so I can let you know what I think about it. I really do appreciate your support. Like I said, you're always on my comments and you're always in my premieres on the live chat and all the rest of it. So I do really, really appreciate that. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Like I said at the beginning, thank you very much, Terry, for helping me buy this bottle. Really, really do appreciate the support. As always, thanks for watching and I hope you all have a lovely day.